Alright, welcome back everybody. My name is Nice Vane, and this is The Game Chaser. Thank you uh, for coming back to my channel and uh, watching me. One thing I wanted to note, I am still new at this. And I am not fully used to s publicly speaking yet. I am part of a podcast, so it should not be a problem. But in this video, I'm going to be a little bit more conscious of my phrasing of things. So I'm going to try not to say uh, um, or do a lot. I mean, I mean, some of you may want me to hear that, you may want to hear that, but I honestly don't know why. But beggars can't be choosers, I guess. Aha! What is this? Nothing. Hello? Okay, what did I do? What did I do? Okay. I don't know what I did there. So, yeah. Thanks again for coming back to my channel. I really appreciate it. Oh, one thing I do want to mention, if you guys liked the video, please share it. Um, oh, there I go again. Oh, no, no. I shot that guy in a very unfortunate place. <laughs> All right. So yeah, I'm going to please share the video if you liked it. Um, I may, that may just be me thinking, okay, they'll actually do it. If you don't actually do it, that's fine. I'm not going to be, I'm not trying to be picky or anything like that. I'm just, I, I'm just asking you know, if you liked the video and you think somebody else would like it, like it as well. Um, just let me know. Just share it actually. Why would I say let you let me know? I mean, sometimes things go. I, I'm multitasking, and so I may accidentally uh, mess up. I may flub my words, if you will. So, forgive me. I'm not a perfect public speaker, so again, I'm sorry if uh or um or but come up a lot. Or if I say the word like, but, you know, I'm not a teenager anymore, so like shouldn't be part of my major vocabulary. And that's kind of a joke. I actually, uh, you know, there were a few times that I know so many, I knew a few people who had the phrase, if I hear like every time you come from your mouth, every time it's unnecessary then I get a nickel more like it except it'd be more phrased like every time you say like and I got a nickel I'd be a rich man or woman depending on who you were talking to but yeah it just seemed like one of those things that you know it was a very typical teen thing to do I'm gonna save right here there we are Save in the new slot, please. All right. All right. Now, I haven't played any farther uh, than last time. Oh, dear. They're closer. Oh, come on. Why isn't he dead? So, I haven't played any farther than last time. Uh, I basically want to keep this kind of a fresh thing for you guys as well. What? What are you saying, AI? AI. So yeah. Oh dear. Things are starting to rumble. Come on, jump over. And like I said, I'm going to try not to say uh, a lot. But yeah, this. Honestly, I really want to keep this game as fresh as I can for you guys because this is a by far. Oh no! 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 I'm really enjoying this game. Oh, the rescue pods are that way. That's where you need to go. No. Nope, can't go in there. Oh, but the door's open. Oh, I shouldn't. <laughs> I kind of want to progress the story. It, it comes down to, do I want to bore you guys with going nowhere? Or do I want to continue the story and enjoy myself? 
honestly, I think I want to enjoy myself more than watching this, than, you know, collectibles. Only because I'm, I enjoy games with story in them. Uh, on our Facebook page, The Almost Experts, I uh, try and post monthly on the free game of the month for Xbox. It's, and uh, a game that came out recently for, for that, well, it didn't come out recently, I don't think anyways, is called Brothers A Tale. I fell. Okay. I think I deserve that one. But it's called Brothers A Tale of Two Sons. And it was a it was a beautiful, beautiful game. Now, it wasn't exactly the most story filled game, however, it was one of the most it had enough story in it by You sound like you sound like a high C-3PO, and I don't like it, not one bit. But yeah, as I was saying, um, can't remember what I was saying. Either. No, darn you, drunk C-3PO. Oh, Brothers of Tale of Two Sons. It's it was one of the best games I've ever played. Not not because it had the the most phenomenal story because even though the story was beautiful it was a couple it was two sons going about trying to save their father from this disease that he had I don't remember exactly I don't even know what exactly it was it was just that uh, he had a disease so they had to go on a journey um, to find the right medicine for him and pop nope come on explode explode Yes! Aha! It worked. Yeah, they went on this journey to save their father. And even though you, they didn't use the English language, they just used their language, whatever it was. And honestly, it was... It, the game in itself, the art was beautiful. Not only was the art beautiful, but the the gameplay was amazing um if any of you play xbox it has a they use the all it uses is the sticks and the triggers and oh my word it was so amazing in my opinion it was amazing that that like how they how they utilize that right, i'm gonna keep quiet a little bit because this seems like an interesting part So basically, the majestic is the ship you're on, and you're, you're, all you know is that your name is Chaser. You're trying to escape a ship that's falling apart, and you're on the ship that wasn't as majestic. Not really as majestic as you think if it's, uh, you know, blowing up. And this is why I think it seems a bit like uh, Star Wars: Knights of the Old Republic. Oh, it's the majestic station. Oh, I see. I get it. Alright. Explosions. Alright. And a little bit like Halo here. But just a little bit. There it goes. Explosion! One thing I do want to note, um, I am going to be making this video a little bit longer. Um, I'm going to try and make this video a bit longer, but that's just a side note. I'm just fascinated by it. Wow. All right. Okay. He didn't say anything there, by the way. See, 
See, one thing about this game that I'm that really intrigues me is where they plan to go with it. And like I said in the last video, this game was made in 2000. And, this game was released in 2003. Oh wow! All oh, right, we're circling Earth's orbit. I see. Montax City Slum. Yeah, I'm really excited to see where they take this game. I like it already, and I have only played maybe 20 minutes, 30 minutes by now. Oh dear. So my name is Stone. Or am I going to be looking for a guy named Stone? Oh, there we are. Oh no! Oh, run! Yeah. Well, that's not polite. I just landed in somebody's apartment. That was rude. Ah. Okay. Looks like I have a shotgun now. Oh. <laughs> that was stupid. All right. All right. Okay. I'm going to save it here. You're going to see me save a lot. I've kind of grown into the habit of doing so because, you know, it's probably for the best all right oh hello oh no get out no fat guy just assumes I comes around the corner just assumes I'm a bad guy well I immediately assumed he was a bad guy anyway <laughs> 